Hey, Rabbi Wilhelm. Hi, Ben. What are you drinking over there? You want some cold, fresh orange juice? Fresh squeezed orange juice? In this weather, it sounds... Uh, it's energizing. Empty. It's energizing. Anyways, how, how was your uh, experience of uh, Gimel Thomas? Well, I, uh, luckily I, I heard some really interesting people. Got some new uh, energy for Nufa Chadasha. For and how is, the new, how is the day after? Hopefully better than the day before and Very continued, good. continued to be. So know, let me tell you two quick Kyle thoughts. Kyle. Tell me, let me tell you two quick thoughts that I heard which apply to Gimel Thomas and then we'll get to the Parsha. First of all, a couple of weeks ago, in the Parsha, it says that when the Maragam went to Eretz Yisrael, they came back with a report, Eretz Eichelas Yeshevel. It's a land that's consuming those who live there. Rashi says the people, the people were busy burying people. They, that's what they saw. They got a very bad impression. I saw a chassidah shot, and I thought, this is mamish what the Rebbe did to us. Eretz is Eretz Yisrael's Kedusha. You know, there are two types of uh, uh, Avedus Hashem. There is... There's Mahalchim and there's Oindim. The, the, the Malachim are Oindim, are fixed. However they were created, that's how they stay. The, the Neshama has to always be a Mahalach, grow. This is what the Torah says. Eretz, Eretz Yisro, or Kedusha in general, Oicheles Yeshiver, consumes people who are fixed. No, in, in Kedusha you can't stay a Yeshiv. In Kedusha you have to be a Mahalach. And when I saw that, I said, bullseye. This is exactly what the Rebbe did to us. Ah! The Rebbe didn't let you stop, stop for a moment. The second you stop, you become lazy, you don't move, you don't do anything. You always have to grow in Yiddishkeit. That's one thing. Then somebody on, on, the, on the shul chat said such a beautiful thing. He says, the Rebbe's yard site is Gimel Tammuz. The Tilim, you saw that one? The Tilim of Gimel Tammuz starts at Kapitel uh, Yudches and it finishes through Chav Beis. And he says, Chai Becha. If you, you, uh, the job of every chassid is to make the, lever, the make the rebel live through you. That is the till. You saw that one? It's a very good shmaka word. Anyways, let's go to to the parsha. There's a chassidish shot from the Urachayim in this week's parsha. Twice, or or maybe even more than twice, the Torah says in this week's parsha, "Vayivoyu kol bnei Yisrael, kol ha'eda," and the Jews. Bnei Yisrael came kol ha'eda. It seems to be repeating itself. Why does he say it in that way? So Rashi says they were all there because nobody else died anymore. All the people who had to die the day of but died. But the Eir Achaim Akadosh says a phenomenal chesedishim shot. He says the Yidin are titled in different in different names. In different names, we have Bnei Yisrael, Bnei Yaakov. Bnei Yisrael is a very high title. Li Rosh, as the Rebbe would say, Yisrael is Rosh Tevis Li Rosh. Uh, the same letters as Lee Reish. And that's when the Yidin are very Baroim Hamaila. So the Erechaim HaKadosh says, listen, that Kol Ha'ida, even the simple folk, don't get, don't just ignore them. B'nai Yisrael is Kol Ha'ida. Every Jew, even the Kol Ha'ida, the simpleton, has has the in potential or deep, deep down, he's really together b- 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 Yisrael. Don't don't look down at anybody. I had a conversation with a chassid from a different chassidus, and he says, you know, our chassidus is this very similar to the way Lubavitch thinks that we always uh, give hope and we always say you you have positive, you have a lot of good things. But there's, I, I explained to him the difference is like this: their chassidus yes gives you a lot of hope and says never give up. But they always talk about it for yourself. Yourself, ne- never fall into a rut. As, as bad as your Achman al you, you fall, you still have good. The Rebbe took it to the next level. The Rebbe says, not even about yourself, don't give up. When you see another Jew, and the other Jew walking in his shorts with tattoos, you can say, he's Kol Ha'eda, he's not one of us. The answer is no. Even the Kol Ha'eda is Yisrael, Li Rosh. And that's how you have to look at every single Jew. And when you have that motivation, you have that uh, that uh, that way of a life and looking at everybody as the same, then the Abish's brach has come down to Klau Yisrael. Now, it looks like you're itching. You want to say something, right? Well, there is something I wanted to share with okay, you. How long is this going to be? You have to catch hours, your bus. Hours. Okay, I'm going to turn around. You're checking it out. <laughs> no? Uh, there's an amazing story that's been going around that uh, I actually was lucky enough to hear the actual recording of Rabbi Moshe uh, Wolfson, who recently passed away at the age of 99. So there are a lot of stories about him. 
going around in general, also with him and the Rebbe. So there's one story in particular regarding when he was in Israel for the summer. He used to like to go to the Israel for the summers. Uh, and one, one year, his daughter, Lalenu, was very, very ill. And um, he had, he, he had like this practice that he went to uh, the Chorba Shul and make sure that nobody was there for Kriyash Malamita. And at nighttime, he was thinking about his daughter and he was thinking about her situation. And it really, really like, bothered him. And when it came to the part in Kriyash Malamita where it says, Nishba Venitka, Lokim, Lasivza, like a um, uh, broken heart. You know, Hashem, don't forgo, don't, uh, don't, don't, um, doesn't ignore it. He, don't doesn't... ignore it. Um, he, he said it repeatedly, and he said that he said it 20, 30 times with tears, and and uh, it was a very, um, it was a very uh, intense kind of a time for him because of his daughter's condition. And he said it not once or twice. He said it throughout the duration of the whole kufa of the summer. And afterwards, he came to New York, back to New York, and the first thing that he did is he went to the Lamavash Rebbe for a bracha, and he came to the Rebbe, and he asked for Yeshua for his daughter. So the Rebbe said to him, you know, when a Yid uh, says of Nishva Venitka, with Kavana, and that's Chos, for sure, the Ebesh is going to help them. Wow. So when he heard that, and nobody was there in the room, nobody was in the shul, I mean, how did the Rebbe, how did the Rebbe know? He had no idea, but to him, that was like a Baal Shamsky Maisa. Yeah. And that happened to him. Can I just, I, I gotta tell you one more word. I wanna turn it around. We're back, we're back. I forgot, just like I said before, that the Yidin have different titles. I'll tell you uh, uh, the Shmaka words for Rabbi Meir Shapiro <clears throat> on this week's Parsha, about the different titles of a Yid. The Gemara says on the, this week's Parsha, Adam Kiyom is Ba'oyo, Says the Gemara, the Tumas oil is only applies to a Jew, because Atem Kruyim Adam, Ve'ena Akum Kruyim Adam. It sounds to be very racist. Only we are man, we are Adam. But no, the Gentiles are not considered Adam. Come on. So the Mayor Shapiro said a beautiful, beautiful shot. He said there are many titles you call a person: Adam, Enish, Ish, Gever. He says there is one difference between the Adam and the other three titles. The other three titles, you could say it's singular and you could say it's plural. Enosh, Anashim, Kvarim, right? The only one you can't say plural, plural and singular is the same word, is Adam. There is no Adamim. So he says, by Lahavdo, the Gentiles, there is single people and there is groups. By a Yid, there is no groups. Every Yid, wherever you are, we all become singular. We all become, we all become one. And therefore, we feel for each other, even though you're very, very far. So this is what the Gemara says: Atem Kriyim Adam. Only Jews you could you could use the title Adam because wherever, whenever you're still one. Ve'ena Akum Kriyim Adam. You have to build that within you, and you know we're all one people. Beautiful. That's